general relativity, step by step. I've got this rather beautiful diagram that we, we've been talking about, and the standard feature I want to mention is this r equals zero set of points here. Um, it's not exactly, well, it's very difficult to talk about because it's a singularity and therefore it's not actually part of space-time. Um, but nevertheless, it, it's, it's instructive to consider the, the fact that this line here corresponding to r equals zero is always, it always has a slope of less than 45 degrees. So light will hit it, but it doesn't emit anything because, it, because the slope is, is, is too shallow for that. And so what that means is that we're in a position now to talk about the singularity of the black hole from the perspective of somebody actually falling into it. Uh, and I'll do that, um, I'll set, set up uh, a new tab here, new section one, just give me a minute. What you think is happening is this, here's me, I might be in a spaceship or I might be in a spacesuit or something like that, and here's a small, a small object with a strong gravitational field. And it cruises along here. This is distance and that's time. And I'm moving along here like this. And I say to myself, ah, what's going on here? Let me have a look. And this small object, this is a Newtonian view here. This small object may send a photon out. It may send a light ray out. I'll draw that in red. And at this time here, I can see it. And I say to myself, ah, there it is. There's a nice object. I might uh, send it a message. And so I can bounce my photon back to that thing and send it a message here. No, I want black. Black. And time carries on travelling along here. And we might send messages backwards and forwards. But I might say to myself, it goes along here. And I might say to myself, ah, oh, well, I want to get away from it now. And I might not be able to. It might sort of suck me in and then bang, I hit it. So that's what you think a black hole is like. Or at least that's what one's Newtonian intuition tells you the singularity at the middle of a black hole is. We're all familiar with this. We're all familiar, or we can think easily about orbiting around Jupiter or something like that, and your rockets fail and, it, and you, you fall into it because of its very strong gravitational field. So this is a very, very, very natural way to view what's happening. However, it's not true for a black hole. Let me go back to the picture here. R equals zero. Is a, it's more like a, a, a time than a place. And so I've developed a, I'll go back here, I've developed a way of thinking about this. Here's, let me uh, do this and I'll pinch it a little bit. Here's me, and here's my head of department. This is me, and this is the head of department. And the head of department, I have my uh, annual performance review with him, and he says, Hankin, you've not done very well. Uh, you, 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 you've been very poorly behaved over the last year. I'm going to have to execute you. And you say, oh, well, that's terrible. I hasten to add the real head of the department is a very nice chap, and execution figures only very rarely in his uh, management strategy. Anyway, so the way he executes someone is that the head of the department has got all these goons, and there they are, they're his henchmen, his goons, and they travel along on a time-like uh, trajectory like that, and they, they, they move along here, and that, that's his goons. And he's got, his goons have strict instructions that at this particular point in time here, at this point in time, whichever goon it is, they've got instructions that when their personal clock hits this blue line here, they are to shoot anyone who sees. They're, they're to shoot anyone they see. Well, they should shoot me, basically. And so I say, oh my God, what am I going to do? Well, I'm trapped, I'm constrained to travel within my light cone. And so I can move within my light cone, but when I get to here, I guess there might be a, a, a large number of goons, and I get shot here. So it's, it's not really possible to view the time of execution in the same way that one views hitting this central, where's it gone? Hitting this central object here. So, I mean, we can send messages backwards and forwards, and I can see myself getting close to it. But this time of execution here, I can't see it. It's just something which I know is going to happen because of the ineluctable 
personnel management systems of uh, of my university. And it's Ooh, dear. and it's no good saying, oh, well, I can get my friend, here he is, and he can send a rope up and pull me. No, he can't. If I was here, if it was this system here, I could do, because I might get my friend who could send out a, a, a rope and, a, and pull me away, because that's how ropes work. But ropes can't help me getting to Monday morning, because I'm constrained to travel forwards in time. I must be inside my light cone at any particular time, and so I have got to be constrained with it. I can't stop time and turn the time round. I can't look at this time of execution. This time of execution, if it does send out any folk, let's say it, it's not really an it, is it? It's a kind of a, well, it's a set of points on a space like trajectory. It will send out photons like that, and I won't see any of those, because wherever I am inside my light cone, when I get there, I'm going to die. The goons are going to get me. They may subsequently send out photons, but I do not know or care about them. So going back to one's picture of the Kruskal Klecker's coordinates, which is here. Let me just uh, neaten that up a bit. It's very similar to uh, my university's HR policy. Because here I am, I'm constrained to be within my light cone, which is at 45 degrees. I've got to stay within that, and whatever I do, I'm going to get trapped, and I'm going to encounter R equals zero, which is going to kill me. So that's one way of understanding the singularity of the centre of the black hole, by using Kruskal-Shekhar's coordinates in this manner here. I'm going to stop there. Stop. <laughs>